Italian. I'm the director of the EC Forest Land and Housing Division. My responsibilities cover basically the work of two committees, one on urban development, so looking into the city's agenda, SDG 11, urban development, uh, challenges cities are facing, including in the post-COVID recovery. And the other file is on forests and forest products, it covers the work of a committee on forest and the forest industry, and is looking at the many challenges that forests are facing nowadays. Of course, all this within the region covered by UNICE. I am a member of the editorial board of UN Today, and as such, I'm out there looking for interesting topics to cover for our staff and from our staff. Uh, I'm looking at uh, different areas, different topics, including, for instance, the new way of working with the UN now under the COVID restrictions. I recently wrote an article about how UN diplomacy works online, but I'm also looking at monuments, art in the Palais, as well as interviewing experts or ambassadors or staff uh, about something of interest to them. I'm also particularly interested in picking the covers of the new UN Today to make sure that they are attractive to our public and speak to them and also speak about what the issue of that specific month is addressing. Two things mainly for the future of UN Today. The first one is to continue the efforts for more outreach not only through printed copies and the web version, but also by the best use possible of social media. And the second one is really to allow different views of staff to be included in the magazine on very important topics for the UN Today, but really give the opportunity to have pros and cons considered and, and really the opposite views even portrayed so that we really give space to all voices of staff and management in the magazine for open discussions that hopefully will benefit all of us at the UN.